Tonight, there are calls for a Slippery Rock school board member to resign. Yeah, they're upset over social media posts she made about the outcome of the presidential election. Barry Pintar talked with people in Slippery Rock to find out what they think about it. Slippery Rock High School, one of four schools in the district serving over 1,800 students. The president of the school board, Heather Scott, doesn't like the outcome of the presidential election and posts this on Facebook. For any of my friends on here who voted for him, kindly remove yourself today. Then goes on to talk about several issues when talking about abortion, writes, quote, that's your religion and your personal belief, so don't expletive have an abortion. And ends her post with, quote, you're all selfish and uses another expletive. Donald J. Trump! The mayor of Slippery Rock Borough, John David Longo, a Marine vet and the youngest ever elected into that office, is a strong Trump supporter, actually speaking at major Trump rallies like this one at PPG Paints Arena. He sees the post, screenshots it, and reposts it with these comments. Many of you have contacted me about this unhinged school board office holder, and goes on to say, this public figure and public school board office holder does not represent who we are as a people or school district, and we wholeheartedly reject her twisted worldview. Debate ensues in this small town. We took Scott's original post into the small downtown area to get reaction to her original anti-Trump post. So as much as you can put politics aside, is that appropriate for a school board president to post online? Absolutely not. Because why? Because it doesn't belong in the school environment. It just doesn't. Of these two women, one didn't want to comment, the other, we live in a country where you are, thank God we have the freedom to say what we want to say. Yeah. Freedom of speech is important. But I think you have to be mindful of the words that you choose if you're in a position of power. The school board vice president and others are now officially calling for Scott to resign. We reached out to both the mayor and the school board president. Neither returned our calls or emails, though the mayor is saying all he has to say is clearly posted on his social media. So where are we left in the middle of all this? Well, the school board president said she will think about what she's going to do next, especially in terms of resigning, and let everyone know when she's ready. Reporting in Slippery Rock Borough, Barry Pintar, KDKA-TV News.